Hello guys, welcome to Ankit Sunyal Wits. Today, I am going to give you tips on preparation for one month before the entrance exam. So let's start. Uh, number one, don't be overconfident thinking that I have prepared uh, for one year or six months. My preparation is good. I have got good ranks in institute. Uh, blah blah blah. Point is, if this time you get overconfident, it will make you lazy and you won't work hard further. Neither you have to be overconfident nor underconfident. You have to be confident only. If you become underconfident, you will lose uh, interest in solving MCQs or interest for reading. So you have to be only confident. See the change uh, when you started uh, your preparation and right now what is the change? Uh, it, I think your confidence will boost up after seeing the change at yourself. In reality, this is the high time for you. You have to solve as many question papers as you can do it right now. And you have to keep revising the course again and again. If you do not solve uh, MCQs right now, um, it, you will lose your skill. You have to practice it again and again. Have to, you have to become perfect in it. While solving the question paper, you will... Uh, have some doubts for that doubts refer to your main textbook don't uh, go look for the explanations given at the back of your MCQ books uh, you will come across a few topics which you are unable to understand or a few questions which you are unable to solve my tip for you is write it down in one sheet of paper and um, sit one day and uh, search answers for all those questions in, in uh, internet or go to respective subject teacher don't waste your full one day uh, looking for answer for one questions uh, because a few questions are tricky even for teachers it would be very difficult uh, to give the exact answer for a few questions so don't break your head in that uh, you don't have to waste your day uh, just move ahead and keep solving other questions uh, when you revise your syllabus one or two times when you will have a better understanding of the basics uh, then maybe those uh, uh, tricky topics uh, you would be able to understand easily you have to be physically healthy uh, you cannot afford to fall sick during this time uh, so have a healthy food have a healthy habits during this uh, this period because if you fall sick then your preparation will lag behind others if possible avoid uh, accidents to drive properly uh, be safe if you are a little bit tense then do not worry uh, because what I think it shows that you are uh, worried about your future so it will motivate you to work hard uh, keep studying hard if you feel stress level is little high try having some stress busting exercises or activities like yoga cooking or go for a walk you know listen to some good music do not think about results right now just only keep working hard stay focused uh, stay away from the people who discourages you or demotivates you or distract you from studying. Simultaneously at this month you need to uh, keep looking for your hall tickets in the website or through the post and you need to keep uh, booking your tickets uh, for the travel to your examination center. Keep, uh, keep all this plan ready uh, side by side and during that duration keep studying also. There should not be any single day when you do not touch your books. Try revising all the subjects uh, portion by portion every day. Every day you have to read. Do not miss any day. So overall there should be three targets for this month. One is to revise your full syllabus at least minimum once. Good if two to three times. Second to solve minimum 10 years of previous year question papers. Third one to write uh, all the important facts or the things which you forget or the formulas in uh, one notebook or in a, in a sheet of paper so which you can revise before one or two uh, days before the entrance exam so it'd be good for you uh, to, uh, to read it fresh one or two days before the entrance exam stay away from social medias, family problems or social issues uh, you have to be calm and keep preparing for your entrance exam uh, don't get distracted you have to give priorities only and only to your studies you have to understand this only your studies matters a lot which will give you a permanent happiness after when you can clear your entrance exam remember this time will never come so do not waste it 
instead of uh, regretting later, it's better to work hard right now. If you have given your 100% uh, for your preparation and you are ready to do so uh, in upcoming one month, so you do not need to be very much. All the positive energy around you and God will help you to achieve your dream and what you deserve. So all the best. See you in my next video. Bye-bye. Thank <laughs> you.